Hey, Brendan Henry here, the world's leading expert in peptide science. Even if you don't want to live to be 100 years old, you still want to have a high quality of life, right? You want to feel and look your best. No one wants to be decrepit or in misery. So all we got to do is reverse our biological aging. Then all of these areas will improve. And we can do it. I'll explain exactly how you can in just a minute. Because even if you were 20, you could be aging as rapidly as a 40 year old. Dooned in pace is a really cool way to measure the pace of aging because it takes what the Horvath clock is famous for, which is analyzing the DNA methylation patterns in our CPG sites of our DNA, and it builds on top of that. It was created using over 20 years of biomarker data from over 1,000 people who were followed since birth, and it shows us how our rate of aging is often a consequence of our environmental factors, such as if we grew up in a low income bracket or had childhood trauma. It also shows us what we're missing out on. For example, our physical abilities, cognition, self-rated health, and even our facial aging is all made worse. But aging starts somewhere in our late teenage years or early 20s. We see it when our thymus function decreases, which is that small immune regulating gland that sits just behind our sternum, our melatonin levels drop, our adrenal hormones like DHEA decline, which causes our free testosterone levels to go down, and so on. Basically, if we look at any of our organ systems and plot the functional capacity of it on a chart by age, we will see a slow decline happening, which begins somewhere in our teens or early 20s. And there are certain factors that are associated with accelerating our rate of aging. Back in the 2012 London Olympics, there was a 20-year-old Russian woman. Her last name was Koneva, and she won the gold medal in rhythmic gymnastics. She was trained under the guidance of Irina Viner, who is the head coach of the Russian national team, and who coached five gold medal winners in a row. So after the tournament, Koneva was fatigued from all the hard training and she had a difficult time recovering. It was then the coach started working with Professor Vladimir Kovinson, the inventor of these bioregulator peptides, on a specific treatment strategy. When he tested her telomeres, he was so shocked to find that they were that of a 40-year-old. He actually tested them again, and after confirming, he put her on a specific peptide regimen that was able to restore her telomeres back to what they should be for her age. Since then, the head coach has been using peptides more comprehensively in her athletes, and she talks about how it really helps with the recovery of her students and prevents them from getting sick in the wintertime. And if you have watched my Pinealon episode, you will see a good example of a peptide that can improve physical performance and recovery in athletes, and even reverse biological age. It's been proven in many studies, even though it's not the best peptide for this purpose. So there are certain risk factors that can accelerate your aging. One of them is extreme sports training and competitions. When we train, we have a hormetic response in our bodies. It involves an upregulation of antioxidant pathways and certain genes that are involved in the adaptation response to help us recover from our training. But if the amount of stress we are under exceeds our body's limits, these free radicals and peroxidizes can lead to glycation and damage our cells. This impairs protein synthesis and overall function, potentially altering our DNA methylation patterns, which is associated with accelerated aging. And this is why longevity experts like Brian Johnson recognize the importance of of exercise, but he's also cognizant not to overtrain because there is a threshold where too much is also bad. And the same could be said for any type of stress, not just training. Hans Seal identified the general adaptation syndrome, which showcases three phases to the stress response, alarm, resistance, and exhaustion. When our bodies are pushed beyond their limits, a chronic stress response occurs, which prevents the adaptation and causes our organs, immune, and metabolic systems to start to fail. And remember what I said about childhood trauma being associated with a faster rate of aging? It's why managing depression and anxiety are so crucial, as is living a healthy lifestyle, getting plenty of sleep, good nutrition, and supplementing where necessary. And if you haven't got our free report, Toxic Testosterone, you should grab that now on unyieldingvigor.com slash toxic dash testosterone, because I cover the dangers of the six most common testosterone supplements that are recommended and tell you what to do instead, and it's backed by 107 scientific citations. And I also created the Ultimate Nutrition System for Peak Male Health, and it's on unyieldingvigor.com on the store page as an add-on to Easy Testosterone and the Peptide Mastery Course. And so it was found that having parents on the lower end of the wealth spectrum is associated with a higher dooned-in pace. So people who were born into conditions where great food and other care can't be provided have accelerated aging, which is why nutrition is just so important. It can literally start in utero, too. Pregnant mothers who were exposed to stress gave birth to a child that had shorter telomeres. So I'm sure that a lot of my listeners today may be suffering from accelerated aging. But don't worry, there are things we can do about it. Like I was mentioned above, just having a healthy lifestyle in general is so important. But we can go beyond that. Bioregulator peptides are incredibly powerful tools in this regard. 
These peptides emerged from the USSR to combat premature aging in submariners, pilots, and missile silo operators exposed to high levels of radiation. And I'm sure a lot of you guys listening have heard to take iodine if you're facing acute radiation exposure. It's because it can occupy the thyroid cells and therefore prevent radioactive elements from binding to it. But that's just one body system. Our entire immune system and organs start to shut down from radiation. But it's the same thing that happens as we get older, too. Radiation exposure, like aging, impairs our metabolism and immune function. For example, I saw an MRI of a young boy who had radiation exposure, and it caused his red bone marrow, which produces hematopoietic uh, cells, to atrophy and be replaced with fat. This process naturally occurs with aging, reducing immune function. And so the bone marrow peptides, which are called myelopeptides, in the thymus bioregulators are so important for immune function and cancer prevention. So anyway, you get the idea. All of our organs become impaired with radiation, just like they do with the aging process. And bioregulator peptides can enter our cells, interact with our histone proteins, and directly bind to DNA regions, affecting our gene expressions. As we age, increased heterochromatin reduces gene accessibility. Some bioregulator peptides can induce deheterochromatization, restoring youthful gene expressions and protein synthesis. And these changes can persist for some time, too. It's been proven in Dr. Bill Lawrence's trials. For those of you who don't know, Lawrence is a doctor from Atlanta, Georgia, who has been running a human trial on these bioregulator peptides. And he is tracking the DNA methylation changes in his subjects, as well as the telomere length. He just hasn't published all the data yet. But he's been having amazing results in reversing aging with these peptides. So reversing aging isn't just about living longer. It's about proving our health span. We want to avoid losing our physical and cognitive abilities. We don't want to live in pain. We don't want to be unable to care for ourselves. My Peptide Mastery course is on pre-order right now. This will be the most in-depth and accurate information on peptides ever made available to the public. There's nothing else like this out there. Right now, it's on sale for $297. If you're interested in peptides, this is a deal you shouldn't miss. But here's the catch. The price goes up to $347 on June 8th. After that, it jumps to $497 on June 15th at launch. Now this course will make you a master of peptides. It will show you how to use them to improve your health and performance beyond anything you thought possible. You'll know more than all the so-called experts out there. No myths, just facts. You can find it at peptides.unyieldingvigor.com. This has been Brennan Henry, the leading expert on peptide science, bringing you another episode of Truth or Lies, the real science of biohacking. Please subscribe and share this video with anyone you care about. Thanks for listening.